Hey, what's up? It's John. I'm up here at Cincinnati Leadership Academy right now. Uh, today is Wednesday, it's the 13th of March. We are doing a weekly series up here, um, teaching the kids lessons about hip hop, love and hip hop. You know, what it actually means, what hip hop is, where it comes from, you know, that, that lifestyle, um, because I think we all live, we all live it, we all relate to it. You know, I actually grew up around here um, when I was younger. Grew up in Roseland, and I went to a school just like this. I moved to College Hill, went to a school just like this. So I was just like these kids, and I'm here to share, you know, the knowledge that I've gained through the years from going to a predominantly black school to a predominantly white school. You know, it kind of changed my views on life, and I got through it with hip hop. You know, hip hop taught me a lot. It taught me about, um, you know, the society we live in. So the least I can do. To, to give back is start these kids off with something that they already know, something that they already enjoy, and take hip hop, teach them a lifestyle behind it, a positive one, and really help them, you know, visualize these dreams that they're thinking about and, and, and capture that. So, so this is my love for hip hop. Jay Wilkes signing out. Rapping, singing, dancing. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have no clue. No clue? Alright. So I want everyone to write this down and I will help you spell this word out. Hip hop is a. It's culture. C U L T U R E. Culture. Hip hop is a culture. Anyone know what culture means? No. No. Okay. I can. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta <laughs> guess. You, you think you know? <laughs> you think you know? Uh, no, I, I can't think about it. It's something that you do every single day without you even knowing. You know that that feeling that you get from music, from hip hop music, it's a good feeling, isn't it? So, do we all know the difference between a good and bad feeling? Yes. yes. Okay, so what I want you to do right now is write down a good feeling. Something that has happened to you, you experienced a good feeling. It made you feel good about yourself. <laughs> or it can be something, it could be a dream, guys. It can be something that you think about, that you want to do one day. If that's a good feeling that you get when you think about it, write it down. I have a dream. So, what I want to talk about right now is, what is love? Oh, no. Write that down, two, go, go two spaces down from your last sentence and just write, what is love? And then write an answer. It can be, it can be, you can love someone or something, but what, how does, how does that make you feel? What is love like? Wait, go ahead. Love and when you feel something that you like and have fun with it. It's, so it's something that you like, it's something that's fun. It's something, it gives you that good feeling. That's what love is. Okay? Are you done yet? Okay, we'll come back to you. I am. What is love? Love is a feeling you have to someone that will never go away, that you would sacrifice your most precious thing for. Okay. I like that. I like that. She said love is something that, it, it's something, you, you love someone, so that feeling, that precious feeling right there, you do anything for them, right? What love means to me like you care about somebody very much? I mean, a lot. A lot. You care about somebody else. Love can be like you really, really like that person and never, never let them go away. So if you really, 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 really like them, do you love them or are you in love with them? What is that? Is like, you're in love with them. You're in love. So what's the difference between in love and love? And love is like, uh, you, like, you really like them. And you can't forget about them, and it's just that you, you just crazy for them. Yeah, crazy for them. Crazy, crazy, crazy. You won't let crazy. them go, and you want to Thinking them. about you. Yeah. I, I, know, I know what you're talking about. I think, I think we can all relate to that because, you know, 
Dude, how many hip hop artists make songs about someone they love or something they love? A lot. Um, and now, don't we sing them? Yeah. 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 And it, it makes us feel good when we sing yeah, that. Like, we think we can sing. Like, you we can feel it at all. So I just left Cincinnati Leadership Academy, and it got me. It got me thinking about a lot. Um, just a lot. You know, we talked to the kids about love and hip hop and life. And they told me some of their life stories, shared a lot of personal experiences and things like that. But uh, it's interesting finding out what they're grateful for. Right, you know, right away they can establish good from bad, a good feeling and a bad feeling. So I, I'm learning a lot throughout, you know, all of this, um, and it's it's very, it, I love it. You know, I, I never, I mean, I know I enjoy helping kids and working with kids and stuff, but I didn't think I would gain as much knowledge that I'm gaining from them because I'm learning just going back to the fundamentals of how I used to think as a kid and you know putting those dreams together and those visions and I'm still chasing I'm still going after it and you know I I love I love showing these kids that you know